All right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video with your big boy, Buddy Gore, and I'm here to take a look at the official trailer for Avatar The Last Airbender. Of course, this is the live-action Netflix. This is the real stuff, okay? That M. Night stuff, get out of here. You taking 25 minutes to lift up a little rock? Remember that, where they did the, like, dance? Whoa, 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 and it's like a little pebble. It's like, what the? It is legitimately... One of the funniest scenes, I think, in cinematic history. Because <laughs> you, you watch the anime, or whatever, if you want to call it anime. I'll call it anime, whatever. Anime-inspired, whatever. Um, and you, you see them, like, lifting big things, and they're like, whoa, 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 so quick. And then you watch the movie, and then it has a $150 million budget, and they're going, ha, whoo, whoo, ha, whoo, 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 and a little rock flies. So like, what the fuck? <laughs> CGS <laughs> looking 1995 rendered freaking rock floats in front. Like, what? Anyway, uh, I've never watched the entirety of Avatar Last Airbender. Just gonna admit it immediately right there. Said it before in the teaser. I only watched the first book when it was airing, so it's been so long. I know. I really want to do a reaction series for it, but uh, I think I'll probably do this. I mean, I haven't watched One Piece since I was a kid, too, and that was just. The first, like, however many episodes that uh, Four Kids aired. So, and I watched that show and I thought it was good. So this is most likely going to be good. So let's actually start this. It was, um, yeah, we can actually skip a lot of this. But, uh, yeah, we'll start from here. But, uh, yeah, I'm excited for this. Uh, we're going to put this because it is Netflix. Sorry, I know it's going to annoy some people. But, uh, hey, you'll be able to tell what's going on. But, uh, yeah, the first teaser was really good. And uh, I expect this one to be pretty good, this actual trailer. And it comes out in, like, a little a little less than a month? Does it come out the 20th of February? 22nd, maybe? So, yeah, a little less. February is going to be a big month, bro. <laughs> There's so many things coming out. I know uh, this is definitely uh, up there. Uh, I'm excited because I, I remember loving Avatar, the first season, the first book, whatever you want to say. And that's pretty much exactly what them that Shyamalan movie covered. I mean, I should say exactly, but you know what I mean. Anyway, let's get to it. First official trailer, let's go. Yep, yep. Here we go. Yes. is embarked on the dark path. And the world might never recover. That budget. The world needs the Avatar. Whoa, whoa! Who needs you, man? Yeah, I'm busting out that ice. Alright. Where's cabbages? The Fire Nation has destroyed everything like, in our path. <laughs> that's the thing I'm excited for. Okay. If the world is gonna have any chance, it's gonna need Aang. Oh, you, don't you mean Aang? <laughs> nice. There goes the savior of the world. <laughs> nice hard cut from the bite into the thing. Down every hint of the avatar. Cairo. It's my destiny. Ah, uh, the fight. I, I... I know someone who can stop the fire nation. Yeah, man, well, that's a chunky. I don't want the response. It's a chunky boy. You don't have to do this alone. You have me, Appa. Tara, and Appa. the flying ball of fur. What more do you need? Yeah, well. <laughs> Perfect 10 seconds. The effects are actually looking pretty good, too. There's a lot of them, too. Ah, uh, music. Oh, there you go. Uh, and this is when, uh, what's his name? Saves them. In the skies, right? <laughs> Zuka. Yeah. Oh wait, that was a what's the thing? Alright. Oh, this, is, this looks really good. <laughs> this looks really good. <laughs> Alright. That looks really good. I got a little bit of chills. <laughs> I got the chills. Alright, hey. Hey, hey, hey. You know what we're going to do. We're going to watch that again. <laughs> we got to watch that again. Got to watch that one again. We're going to crank it up a little bit, too. Oh, no, no. We ain't going to watch it from here again. No, 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 no. All right. 
Watch out one more time before I even say anything. I, I will say the the special effects look really good. Like I I figured the budget was pretty big, but like how many episodes are there? Eight? I'm gonna guess eight. It's looking like it's doing a good job of. Who needs you, man? Yeah, I love the the music. That's really good. The Fire Nation has destroyed everything in their path. As fire does. If the world is gonna have any chance, it's gonna need any. <laughs> it's right. pretty good. That was, the the that was my favorite move in uh, Nick, Nick, Nickelodeon All Star Pro. <laughs> Chase down every hint of the Avatar. It's my destiny. Yeah, and then back to back, that's so cool. I'm not someone who can stop the Fire Nation. That's a Johnny Gatton I don't actor, want right? Responsibility. You don't have to do this alone. You have me, Tara. And a flying the, offer. The, what more do you need? The, the casting is pretty good. Remember when I I, I may, correct me if I'm wrong. Weren't they considering making this way more adult? At one point, wasn't that like a news story that came out? This looks very accurate and fun and at you know accurate and you know good and accurate. <laughs> it's accurate. I guess technically the movie was accurate. It still followed things that I remembered from. The, I mean, obviously it was condensed, but like. So that I guess was good, but it was just it was bad. It's <laughs> just so it was a badly done. The cast seems good too. The world needs you. Oh, no, that's a good thing. What it is gl is glider thing. And so this is the uh the 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 when they're imprisoned, right? Is that the, the that scene? Wait, is this is this that um? I haven't seen the first season since I was a kid. So when it when it aired was the last time I watched. It. I probably re watched like reruns. I probably did leading up to season two when that was coming out. But um, yeah, it's it's been a little while. So excuse me if I don't remember a lot. Um, but is, is this this is the uh, where they're enslaved and and then they break you know like Ang gives the speech and he's like oh, fucking break free bitch, you know, and then they do the dance for twenty minutes and then lift the little rock. <laughs> And then a little fucking wait. Uh, do I have something? Do, do I have a little rock? Here, I have my lip balm. This thing flies away. <laughs> I don't have a rock near me. I'm surprised I don't have a rock just randomly in arms Oh yeah, I want to see right here. I forgot this character's name, but the crazy old uh, his friend. Is that who this is supposed to be? With my friends. Friends. So, yeah, that, that's totally him. I forgot his name. Fuck. His friend. Uh, fuck, what's his name? It looks really good. It looks good. Uh, I'm actually excited. Really. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That's good stuff. <laughs> the last airbender. Not that James Cameron shit. You just switch the name to not that James Cameron shit, The Last Airbender. Damn good trailer. Damn good trailer. I, I I got a I got a feeling people are happy about that. Yeah. Hey, it, it's a hey, it is a well, alright, maybe I shouldn't say this yet. But we are in different in a different time when it comes to anime adaptations. You know, we are far past The Last Airbender, the movie, and Dragon Ball Evolution, which both came out in the span of a year. Uh, <laughs> which, are, again, technically Avatar The Last Airbender is not anime, because it's not made from in Japan, right? But it's anime in spirit. We all, come on. Everybody considers it an anime. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. It's an anime. In spirit, and in storytelling, and, and love, and passion, it's anime. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's just like it's it like we're like One Piece was really damn good. Um, I liked Yu Yu Hakusho. It definitely does not tell a story accurately, but I thought the action was great and 
the way they told the story wasn't accurate, but I still enjoyed it. It's five episodes. What is it all together? Maybe two, three hours long all together. Uh, maybe not even that. Probably like closer, like two thirty. It it really doesn't accurately tell, tell it. Like both Botan just completely got sidelined, um, and a lot of characters did too. Like Hie was barely a character. Um, Karama, same, like, nowhere, like, a lot of the characters just weren't the characters from the anime, but if you watch it as just a fun little action show, it, the action was really good, very well choreographed. Um, this looks like the same thing, it's well choreographed, but it looks extremely accurate, and the characters are what I remember from them. Uh, Sokka was a little bit more, uh, zany, I would say, like, with his humor, I would say, but uh, that's just this trailer. We we saw him like tops like twenty seconds in this trailer, so can't say that. But like Iro and and Zuko look perfect uh, for the most part, from what I, again remember. Uh, I'm only talk about the first season, which is perfect because that's what this is covering. So what I watched, this is what's covering. So it looks great. I think it looks really fucking good, actually. So there you go. That's it. Bye.